The tarmac shimmered under the Indian sun, casting a golden hue across the vast expanse of the airfield. The air buzzed with anticipation, a palpable energy coursing through the crowd as they eagerly awaited the spectacle. Aero India 2025 was in full swing, and the skies over Bengaluru were alive with the roar of jet engines, each one a testament to human ingenuity and engineering prowess. From across the globe, aviation enthusiasts, industry giants, and military delegations had gathered for this biennial spectacle, a melting pot of cultures united by a shared passion for flight. It was more than just an air show. It was a stage where cutting-edge technology shared the spotlight with breathtaking aerial displays, each maneuver a dance of precision and power. Among the gleaming metal birds, one aircraft stood apart, its silhouette a stark departure from the familiar, capturing the imagination of all who beheld it. The Sukhoi Su-57, Russia's premier fifth-generation fighter jet, had arrived at Aero India, and its presence was impossible to ignore. Sleek and formidable, it was a marvel of modern engineering. Now, the Su-57, nicknamed Felon by NATO, was a statement. Its design and capabilities were a bold declaration of Russia's aerospace ambitions. Its arrival at Aero India was a clear signal from Moscow, a demonstration of its growing aerospace capabilities on a global platform, a reminder of its prowess in the skies. All eyes were drawn to this enigmatic aircraft, eager for a glimpse of its rumoured capabilities. Cameras clicked, capturing every angle of the felon. The stage was set for the felon to take centre stage at Aero India 2025. The anticipation was electric, the crowd on the edge of their seats. The anticipation in the air was palpable, a mix of curiosity, awe and a hint of apprehension. What would this marvel of engineering reveal in its flight? The world was watching, ready to witness the Russian Raptor take to the skies. As the engines roared to life and the aircraft ascended, it was clear that this was more than just a flight. It was a statement of power and innovation. The arrival of the Su-57 at Aero India 2025 wasn't just another aircraft demonstration, it was a powerful symbol of Russia's re-emergence as a major player in the global fighter jet arena. This event marked a significant milestone, showcasing not only the aircraft's advanced capabilities, but also Russia's commitment to maintaining its status as a leading force in military aviation. The Su-57, also known as the T-50 during its initial development phase, represents the culmination of decades of Russian aerospace engineering. This aircraft is the result of years of research, development and testing, aimed at creating a fighter jet that can compete with the best in the world. The Su-57 is Russia's answer to the American F-22 Raptor and F-35 Lightning II. These American jets have long been considered the pinnacle of fifth-generation fighter technology, but the Su-57 aims to challenge that dominance. It's designed to be a highly maneuverable, stealthy and lethal air superiority fighter, capable of engaging multiple targets simultaneously and penetrating sophisticated enemy defenses. The aircraft's agility and stealth capabilities make it a formidable opponent in any aerial combat scenario. The Su-57 boasts a suite of advanced technologies, including a powerful radar system, sophisticated electronic warfare capabilities, and a revolutionary flight control system. These features ensure that the Su-57 can operate effectively in a variety of combat situations, from dogfights to long-range engagements. It's also armed with a variety of air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missiles, making it a versatile platform for a wide range of missions. Whether it's taking out enemy aircraft or striking ground targets, the Su-57 is equipped to handle the task. The Su-57's presence at Aero India 2025 wasn't just about showcasing its capabilities, it was also a strategic move by Russia to attract potential international partners. By displaying the aircraft at such a prominent event, Russia aims to secure new contracts and expand its influence in the global arms market with its impressive performance and advanced features. The Su-57 has the potential to reshape the balance of power in the global arms market. As countries around the world look to modernize their air forces, the Su-57 stands out as a top contender, offering a combination of cutting-edge technology and proven combat effectiveness. The future of aerial combat is rapidly evolving, and the Su-57 is at the forefront of this transformation. As it continues to demonstrate its capabilities on the world stage, 
the Su-57 is poised to become a key player in the next generation of fighter jets, solidifying Russia's position as a leader in military aviation. At the controls of the Su-57 was Sergei Bogdan, a highly decorated test pilot of the Russian Aerospace Forces. Bogdan's career is a testament to his dedication and skill, having earned numerous accolades and medals for his contributions to aviation. Bogdan is no stranger to pushing the limits of aviation technology. He was instrumental in the Su-57's development, accumulating countless hours of flight time in the various prototypes. His commitment to advancing aviation technology has made him a key figure in the aerospace community. Bogdan's experience extends beyond the cockpit. He is renowned for his technical understanding of the Su-57, often providing valuable feedback to the engineers and designers back in Russia. His hands-on approach and deep knowledge of the aircraft's systems have been invaluable. His insights have been crucial in refining the aircraft's flight characteristics and combat systems. Bogdan's ability to communicate effectively with the engineering team has led to significant improvements in the Su-57's performance and reliability. During the Aero India demonstration, Bogdan put the Su-57 through a series of maneuvers that left the crowd awestruck. The audience watched in amazement as the aircraft performed with precision and grace. The felon danced through the sky, showcasing its incredible agility and responsiveness. Each maneuver was a testament to the aircraft's advanced design and Bogdan's exceptional piloting skills. Bogdan effortlessly executed high G-turns, rapid rolls and near-vertical climbs, pushing the aircraft to its limits and demonstrating its capabilities in a way that few pilots could, demonstrating the raw power and maneuverability that set the Su-57 apart. The aircraft's performance in the sky was a clear indication of its superiority in modern aerial combat. Bogdan's presence at Aero India went beyond just piloting the Su-57. He engaged with the audience, answering questions and sharing his experiences, providing a deeper understanding of the aircraft's capabilities. He was Russia's ambassador for the aircraft, embodying the skill and expertise that went into its creation. His interactions with the crowd helped to build a connection between the audience and the technology on display. His performance was a testament to the capabilities of both the machine and the man behind the controls. The synergy between Bogdan and the Su-57 was evident, showcasing the pinnacle of modern aviation technology and piloting prowess. The Su-57's sleek, blended fuselage isn't just for show. It's the result of meticulous design and engineering aimed at minimizing its radar cross-section making it significantly harder to detect on enemy radar systems. This stealth capability is crucial in modern warfare, allowing the Su-57 to penetrate enemy airspace with a reduced risk of being detected and engaged by adversaries. The Su-57's stealth features extend beyond its shape and form. It incorporates radar-absorbent materials in its construction, further reducing its radar signature significantly. The aircraft's engines are also designed to minimize its infrared signature, making it more difficult to track with heat-seeking missiles. At the heart of the Su-57's advanced avionics suite is its powerful N0-36 Bielka radar system. This sophisticated radar provides the Su-57 with a 360-degree view of the battle space, allowing it to detect and track multiple targets simultaneously even those employing stealth technology. The Su-57's electronic warfare suite is another critical component of its survivability. It includes a variety of sensors and jammers designed to detect, identify and neutralize enemy radar and missile systems, providing the aircraft with an extra layer of protection in contested airspace.